Tornado here. And Ray here as the translucent Demi Fiend, the newest character that's totally not the Demi Fiend in this new fighting game, taking up another character slot. I'm sorry, I'm making a very weird joke. A nocturne tale. Exactly. So anyways, you know where you need to go, so continue on. Photo Mimi from last time. <laughs> so you asked me something that caught me off guard. Yep, and I asked you, do you remember Pokemon Tournament? Because I sure as fuck forgot. Oh, uh, I do. I still have some favorite avatars on there. Uh, why do you bring it up? I don't know. It's like one of those things that I was just like, huh, I kind of forgot that was a game that came out less than a year ago. Why do I forget that it existed? <laughs> It's like with Generation 6 of Pokemon- oh fuck, Pokemon X and Y. I was just like, fuck, Generation 6 was a thing, why don't I remember it happening? <laughs> I played it and I liked it a lot back then, but I fucking forgot. Everyone, listen to me, I've seen the future. But right, we know that, that, that you told us that's why you went to meditate. Right, but I did it this time, for real, guys. <laughs> Wait, so, so you are lying before? I, I'm very sorry. <laughs> You just really needed some hope. <laughs> oh, you okay. really needed some hope. <laughs> really different from the ways that like, I thought you were going to go. Well, I just... Uh, at first, I thought, like, I see, I see the future. And nobody remembers poking tournaments. <laughs> Maybe if they improve it then, in the sequel or make it a less weird game. And then, like, uh, continue on with that. It was, uh, like, you beat your lie to us last time. Yes, but I foresaw that you would forgive me, so you'll get over it. <laughs> <laughs> what I am about to say is critical to our future. We're all gonna die unless we, like, jump right now. <laughs> 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 uh, what? Do it! <laughs> and then they all jump, and then we see this weird wave of darkness. It's like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, we dodged Dormammu's level 3 from Marvel vs. Capcom. <laughs> it's a weird sewer, it only hits the floors. <laughs> Oh, I'm getting weird on these jokes now. <laughs> Every one of you has worked hard for our peace ever since we escaped from, uh, escaped from the mantra. But another power is being born that could potentially bring our efforts to naught. Yes, it's Yoyogi. I don't remember. Isn't that the thing at the beginning of the game when the two cults were fighting and shit? And it was like, oh, this is Yogi Park, and then this other weird ass shit, and then they died. Yeah, it was just the park name, that's right. The two cults are fighting at Yogi Park. I'm not gonna read that, what he's talking about right now. <laughs> The evil power will take form in Yogi Park. Remember that's that? probably why it sounds familiar. I wonder if that's the name of the god that's approaching. <laughs> right now, it is but a mere shadow. Oh, good. That means it's not fully formed into a demon yet, because we're not at Persona 5. Hmm. Hooray for weird jokes that don't make sense anymore. However, when it takes form, it will have enough power to change the face of the world. I know, it's weird to understand that we didn't know the world had a face already. Weird, right? Now it's going to be a different face, like... Like, highly advanced and more global-scale plastic surgery. Is this pun going far enough yet for you to get it yet? <laughs> he said, change the face of the world, and I'm stretching it to the farthest pun I can. Of a, gl a global-scale plastic surgery. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Ah. Damn this chair in its stupid battle! I didn't touch it even! Fuck! Okay, sorry about that. I'm very sorry I had to really stretch this fucking pun. <laughs> sorry you didn't get it. Yo, Yogi Park. A threat to mannequins. But we should not fear this. We have learned to work together. If we join forces, we will, we will be able to fight this evil power. Let us work harder and prepare that time. For that time. We will not fall to the power that is brewing in Yoyogi Park. The future is there for us to change. We will create our own path. There will be an end to our journey. A world where we are free from suffering. I thought he was going to say destruction. I don't know why. Yes, the world of mannequins will surely come. Later. <laughs> but aren't you gonna come with? Nope. <laughs> but you're a lit. Nah, I know. But see ya. Damn. So I. Oh. Oh. Okay. I thought they left. Photomimi's prophecies have never been wrong. Photomimi mentioned Yoyogi Park. There must be something important there. I'm gonna cut a bitch. But first, I was so wrapped up in Photomimi's words, I completely forgot. I need to restore the city! I need to rush back! And then he stayed here forever. Yeah, so take that safe terminal uh, back to... Main Asakusa. Save! And then uh, continue forward as if you're proceeding in the town. Another area has opened up for you to explore. And hopefully, you can avoid a boss battle. 
Is the, is the new place was stored because like, hey guys, look, we built like a ramp under the sand here. <laughs> it's like, why'd you do that for? Well, we thought we could do a thing. Oh, hey, it's Hijiri again. What's up, Ark? Find anything interesting? I heard you can't get inside Mantra's headquarters right now. The mannequins are worried. Once again, the mantra is where I was just fucking at, right? But they got blown up from the beam cannon. Oh, right. Uh, if you had, like, gone up and checked the doors, you would have gotten a message saying it's sealed shut. Okay, that confused me, because it's like, what? Wait, I went in there, like, a week ago <laughs> or something. <laughs> <laughs> Man, some other freaking, like, squatters come in there and make home there and lock the doors. Former members of mantra could be involved, but most likely they wouldn't try anything without a leader. So, they're making a new one, just like everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> Which reminds me, lately I've heard talk about Futomimi. Maybe those mannequins are up to something themselves. I wouldn't trust them. Well, I never did, because they seem twitchy. <laughs> yeah, just a little twitchy. <laughs> Alrighty, so, file two still, right? Yes. Alrighty. Okay, so, uh, I believe I was gonna bring up my problems with, uh, Hikawa's... Wait, is that a name? Yeah, the dude, the main bad okay. dude right now. Yeah, his reason of... No. Like, have you ever found uh, any goodness and like uh, that way of thinking? Everybody that, like, should just yeah. work for the one purpose only. Yeah, not have any freedom, just like, you know, work as like perfect wheels in the cog. Yeah, like as cogs and... No, uh, go back. Oops. Then uh, take the stairs... You know, that way, like, uh, there would be no worry because they wouldn't have to make choices that would cause them to worry or something like that. Hmm. Like, uh, you ever... F Does that seem appealing at all to you? No. Unless you're somebody that wants to live a really simple life. Hmm. Like Hank Hill from King of the Hill and his love for propane, but that's all he wants to do without any other crazy complications. Like everybody else around him in his life. Like that Asian Laotian guy next door to him. Also gets his insults every day, but if he had no free will and was just a cog in the machine, he'd be nice to talk to. <laughs> <laughs> just yeah, like me. I was me. told to talk to him. <laughs> it's just like me, Hank Hill, the cog in the... Hey, he's not really a cog in the machine. I was just making fun. Okay. Well, there's a what, candelabra room. Should I assume the guy covered in faces has it for some reason? There's evil power at your Yogi Park out here, but we work together to build this city. We'll beat down that evil power. And then we okay, go there, but... So, if I were you... Oh. Like, ideally, you wouldn't fight him right now. But, uh, you know, stuff happens. Wait, so, the candelabrum uh, thing or the face dude? I was joking about that. Like, he's the executor? The next rider. Oh, okay. The, you're coming upon the next rider. Yeah. Don't go too far. So, anyways, that you're going to want a Maga Magatama, your choice. One that either voids sleep, because he'll cast that on you a lot. I see. Or one that boosts your magic because you could just go in there and just spam your strongest spell in order to get rid of him as uh, much as possible, which is Tornado. Because he has no immunities to that, and neither does any of his helpers. So, which would you rather do? Try to out-blitz him with your Tornadoes, or try to outlast him, him doing his shenanigans with sleep? Hmm. Hmm. I never got this Mangatama leveled yet, which is one problem. Oh. Uh, okay, well... Okay, yeah, fine. Bite uh, me, damn it! <laughs> but, uh, which would you, uh, prefer to, like, uh, do? Not quite sure. The anti-sleep would be helpful. Uh, okay, that bad. was dumb. You should have died from that. There we go. Accuracy moves! Okay, one more of those. <laughs> okay. Well, there is something else to keep in mind before you take on this person. Yeah. <clears throat> and that would be, uh, you can spam, like, uh, your debuffs on him. He will not cure that, I think. And then, uh... Huh. Do you have any, uh, demons on you that has the spell Siku? I don't... I built this in that way I gave her? No, a Rakunda. What was Dakunda? Lowers attack? No, uh, Dakunda removes any debuff that the enemy puts on him. Oh. Because that's one of the big strategies that this guy is going to use. He's going to summon his two allies and they're just going to debuff the heck out of your group. I see. Which is why it uh, kind of becomes like a DPS. You want to, like, you know, 
out kill him with your tornado spam. Okay, these are not 14, they're at 13, but that makes them pretty close together, so uh, eeny meeny miny mo, I choose agility for now. One more point for that, and one more point for duck. And then I've got the 15th of the thing. No ultra death for me, because that's never gonna work. <laughs> Let's be for real here. Yay! I now have the full power of the first level from Hitman 2. <laughs> <laughs> first level of that game is called Anathema. I don't know what the word means. In hmm. fact, I thought it was a place, so I misunderstood that completely. <laughs> Alright, now it should oh. be safe to throw on the... this one. Hmm. Damn it! <laughs> I hit the circle by accident. Okay, but uh, check your uh, demons. Uh, yeah. Yeah, dude. Do, do you pretty have someone sure, with the skill, Dakunda? Pretty sure nobody does, because I don't think I've seen that skill in forever. It's possible somebody does, and I just don't remember it. Rakunda, doody do. Rakunda. The Kaja, that's not it. But what does it do? Cancel Kaja effects on all enemies. So I could get rid of their buffs if they had any. Nah, I don't remember them buffing. Hey, look. Lilim has Tarunda. I didn't even know that. Hmm? Weird. Weird that she has that skill, hmm. Not really. Oh. Because, like, the lower level demons get those quite a bit for some reason. Don't see no Dakundas, so should I try to get a demon that has that? Hmm. I would suggest it. Like, uh, you probably have a demon somewhere stored away that has it. And although I'm suggesting that you avoid the first encounter, yeah, it wouldn't help having this demon for when you really decide to go and kick its butt. So anyways, what was the same before? I don't know, I kind of forgot now. Lots of stuff happening, man. LPs are crazy like that. Oh, right. Uh, the, uh, being a will in the cog uh, without, you know, Oops. no worries because you don't have to think for yourself. I never quite agreed with that. Sentimentality? Is that the right word I'm looking for? M mentality? Yeah, it probably is. Like, uh, mentality. Because I, I'm always... Like, Huh. I wonder when I got it that way. Or I am highly of the opinion that even if freedom does bring, bring like pain and suffering, it's still freedom. You know, it still allows the, you to be you. And like, I never saw the appeal of like I giving up that freedom so I could live with like no worries just because, like, someone else could make all my decisions for me. Like, I'm sure, like, for some, that, like, uh, frees up a feeling of responsibility of some sort or something like that, which I guess is a, supposed to be the appeal of it. It's just the trade-off just never seemed worth it to me. Hmm. Starting to think maybe I could have put that Kikuri as a good support skill. Hmm. Maybe. I don't remember it, like, uh, coming up all that much to where it's like, you know, oh, yeah, you gotta get this skill, otherwise, like, uh, things are gonna go bad. I mean, I've dealt with everybody beefing up before, I just had to beef up myself, too, to match up. Hmm. Which wasn't impossible, but it would be helpful to stop them. Like, that last time I had that battle out, Blitz the Dudes. Yeah, but I don't think they were, like, lowering you at the same time. Mm, I see what you mean. That would be troubles. Really, nobody had it. That's crazy. To be this far, and I haven't seen a certain skill, a certain low-level skill. I need to check that text in a minute. Hmm. Okay. Uh, no, it doesn't look like nobody has it. I just haven't seen it yet, but still. Huh. What? No, it's, it's kind of odd that like uh, you've gone through like a decent portion of the compendium at this point. And I'm surprised fair, I haven't seen it once. To be fair, we haven't exactly leveled up any of them. That I have to have skills. Wait, okay, I thought he had it. No. Lots of Rakundas, but no Dekundas. This one's got all these ones. <laughs> Are you sure it's Dekunda? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, it's uh, Dekunda. Is a move that removes enemy stat, like debuffs that they would put on your group. Huh. Well, that's everybody, because now we're back down to this since you're the first one I started on. 
Okay, so it's still possible to get through the fight. You know, I mean, like you're not uh, aiming to fight him right now, as it were, anyways. But I could give it a dang old good try. Right. Actually, I'll... I should just go ahead and save since I did the stupid Makatama. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, save afterwards. Why? Uh, because you're going down there to get some. Remember, what I said you don't want to fight him immediately right off the bat. All right, but if I stayed before and I had the Magatama already fixed up, and then... Uh, you would just have to readjust the Magatama. Like, wait. Because I'm saying I got the one completed, so... Uh, it's fine, probably. Right. Yeah, I'm going to say it's fine. <laughs> yes, let the record show that I'm going to say it's fine. Uh, no. It chased and... you. Okay. Okay. So, uh, make a left. And go through that door. And then uh, you can check out the door to your left. There's that. If you go south from the exit up ahead, you'll reach Yushima Station. There's a giant hole there. We call it the Asakusa Tunnel. Is it in the ground and you call it a tunnel? Or is it in the earth as a walkable tunnel? Eh, both. <laughs> what? Hey, look, it's a store, I think. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's always the same guy. What am I talking about? Oh, no, it's not. It's like somebody different. He even has to zoom up. <laughs> Customer. <laughs> I'm sorry, I always wanted to say that. You remember me, huh? I'm the mannequin that collects all sorts of junk. Wait. Oh, this weirdo. I forgot about him. <laughs> I you remember him. Yeah, I actually completely forgot. It's been a long ass time. Wasn't he in the same area as the other weirdo? What, you know, the first time I ran into the shopkeeper? He was uh, all like, hey, handsome, how's it going? They, I feel like it was yeah, kind of the they same were area. in the same tunnel. I finally opened my own shop. Take your time and look around since you helped me out before. Oh wait, that was not a comma. Oh, it was a period. Since you helped me out before, I'll sell it to you at a wholesale. Don't know what that means, so whatever. Fuck it, I don't care. So yeah, this guy has some new magatama for you. Oh boy, one of them is Kamurugi and Vimana and Sophia, and the other one is what the hell's a wagtail? <laughs> But yeah, look at the price of those Magatama. Yeah, their absurdity is up, up the charts, off the charts. Especially Sophia there. Yeah, I know. That's I can see that, Edo. Thanks for pointing that out. I am clearly... I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm milking this one a little too hard. <laughs> I didn't mean to drag you under the bus for about three miles on that one. <laughs> I just realized I should have bought one at a time. Oh wait, he doesn't do the tickets, does he? Yeah, he does. Oh, fuck. Oh, now I have to restart the entire game now. <laughs> <laughs> get ten of them and bring them back here anytime. I'm just getting them in. This is actually a very inconvenient place to try to grind for the tickets, though, so I would never give a damn about it. Hmm. But oh. he does uh, spell. Uh, spell? Sells uh, chakra drops. Well, so yeah. that's handy. There it is. I was like, there's a button for it. I'll probably use these all up before I have to go shopping again anyway. Wait, that makes complete fucking sense and it makes it redundant as fuck. <laughs> Because I don't, I just realized what I fucking said. <laughs> I'll double restock them with these later if I keep using them. <laughs> okay. Ugh, fuck. So, Remember yeah. how Tales of Series had, what was it, 15 items as the fucking limit? That was weird. Yes. Yeah, I remember feeling there's no way I'm gonna get through this RPG of a game with only like 15 health items that only restore 30% of my health upon use. Then we got the 60% and everything was kind of mellowed out. Well, no, it was like, even before then, this, that game was not difficult because, no. Well, it was too fun, that's why. That is? It was fun for me. I, just, like, I remember like the combat system allowed for it to where you'd actually be able to get through a lot of fights without getting hurt. Especially if you were a Lloyd and you were just... Like, man, what was that thing called when you just... Sword Rain Alpha! I have no idea. Yes, yeah, Sword Rain. Oh, okay. But, uh, yeah, uh, continue along that path. Talk to that dude. You look hurt. Are you okay? I saw Sakahagi earlier. He went down the hall. This hall or the other hall? To the left. My left? Yes. Facing me. What? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, go down that hall. Time to fight Sakagihag. And make a right. Uh, what's the other one? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, what's so important? It's, I can't look that way. It's save point. Very okay. useful. Now you can save here. So should I have the Magatama rechanged now? Because uh, I'm not you fighting said the you bone wanted, boss? Uh, no, like you are going to fight the bone oh, boss. Oh, so this is... Well, yeah, wait. it's like save now so that uh, when you fight the rider, if you lose, 
you won't have to go too far. Okay. I mean, you made your adjustments, you bought some new Magatama, which I guess now is a little bit too far for us thinking about it, because you're going for immune uh, statuses it's not, and that's not, superfluous. not, you know, boost strength. Speaking of which, I want to look at them. Oh, fuck, which ones are they? <laughs> Uh, Kurumurugi. Parts physical attack skills. Physical resistance and weak to magic. Blight. That doesn't sound like a physical, but it's probably stuff like poison needle and shit, so it's got status element physical. Yeah. Imparts physical attack skills. Nerve is null. Stun and blind. Endure. Oh, that's different. So, yeah. I'm... Defensive physical. Right? Uh... No. I don't quite remember, but I just remember like that I made sure to make that a priority. Because don't you remember what Endure is? Deathbound! Well, wait, no, Endure. What does Endure do? You just survive no matter what? <laughs> if you would die, you will survive it instead. Yeah, like, uh, once uh, per battle, you will survive with one HP remaining. That would seem very useful for me, finally. Yeah. I might just have to get rid of Void Mind, finally. Hmm. I Maybe. forget, did I try Violet Flash? No, I don't think so. Fuck, I forgot I even had it. I just looked at it and was like, wait, what's that doing there? Oh, wait, this is the one. Imparts healing spe- Wait, wait, what the hell's Thunderclap? I thought that was- Wait, imparts healing spells- I right, now look spell, but I can learn the ultimate thunder move for me? No, Thunderclap is a expel maneuver. That's weird. All right, whatever. It's, you know, like the bolt of lightning from God kind of thing. It's still weird that it's in its healing spells, but it's a non-healing move. Right. Meanwhile, deathbound, that's the thing. Oh well, whatever. Anywho, onward! Uh, what was it doing? Up the stairs. Uh, now it's to your left. Wait, what? Oh, that leaves. Ah! Demons! Oh, wait! Attack from behind! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! How long has it been since you've been, like, attacked like that? Way too long. Which makes it superfluous to have that skill of don't get back to attack by 30% less. So what am I doing now? Well, uh, it's exit. Yeah, okay. well, from what I hear, it's quite handy, especially if you're going, like, a super top difficulty. Considering, like, back attacks are, uh... Um, commonplace. Yeah, more commonplace in that difficulty of the game. In fact, every battle! The flames of the candelabra are blah 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 Okay, so then, you remember where you were almost drawn into a battle? Yeah. So you can run around, get yourself Dark Might, and then challenge him. Where exactly on the map was that? Was it over this way? Now, I asked you if you remembered where you were drawn into that battle. Was it at that corner up there on the right? I believe so. Okay, because I was like, wait, where am I? How would I remember where I was? What do you have to say? There's a temple on the north side of Ueno, but you can't get in, so there's nothing to see. I bet that's for Yadagarasu and... No, wait, what's it called? Hold on, was that the name of that crow? That um, one with the three legs or whatever it was? Yeah, the the three-legged uh, crow is known as Yatagarasu. Okay. I was going to say where we Yatagarasu and Raido are hanging out at. They're at that temple, right? <laughs> <laughs> These games were made at the exact same time, right? So they totally did that. Okay, so if I go all the way to that corner... Like, because I don't know where the exact barrier is going to be because I'm coming at a different angle now. Yeah. I think, uh, more or less around there. Like, I would, uh, at least, uh, get past the, uh, Stairs? hallway that's to your right. Uh, talk to you. Evil power. It's him. Definitely him. Okay. So, I'm a bit scared, actually, to go past this hallway. Just stay at this hallway and then go. Oh, good. That makes it easier. Oh, fuck. <laughs> go you away. You have, like, an, uh, propel spray sprayed on. Oh no, cats and dogs working together. <laughs> what kind of world is this? <laughs> All right, demons. Hmm. Okay. So. Fuck. Okay, good. I did. I thought it was gonna be like, oh, if you're at this like same area of the corner, I didn't think it would be at this same area exactly. Terrifying presence. I will stay here. Are you sure? It's never sure when I'm sure about me dying by fighting death. Hmm. So is a pale rider a trumpeter because I know he's in here. Oh, I, got, I gotta find the last of the horseman, and I heard a horse. Yeah, there he is, pale rider with his blue eyed horse and his scythe, death himself. It is time to settle this once and for all. Let us see whether or not you can best the four knights of death. Can a human with the strength of a demon? 
overcome the inevitable fate of death? Nay, say I. Death himself. I shall pass final judgment on you. Ha! <laughs> I think sounds like Skeletor when we get into the battle. <coughs> Behold the land of the dead. It encroaches from before you and behind you. That's what this place is? I guess that makes sense. Beware, or it will engulf you in an instant. Oh, it's a much cooler voice. Oh, he's summoned Chandra Skulls with a snake in him. Loa, that's what he's called. Couldn't you get this in Rido Kuzunoha? Yes. <laughs> Although I can't remember if it was number one or number two. Okay, so my options are Fog Breath. <laughs> right? They're gonna attack me, so. Well, actually, you're gonna like uh, be reducing your stuff. Right. But I can lower the defense, right? Uh, yeah, sure. Should be fine. Oh, right. Damn it. Uh, what did I forget? As soon as I No, no, I was like, like, what did I forget? And I should tell you that he voids ice. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I don't exactly have anybody with that right now, but that's good to know. Uh, I just realized I probably shouldn't have her in here. Why no, wait, she has Dark Might on her. I could smack a bitch. <laughs> wait, why did I do that? Well, we get an extra turn. Fuck it. Uh, can he do anything? He can do fire, but we want to attack. So, Bob Breath again for the hell of it? Yeah. You can get at least like good of um, for like their full effects. And then uh, attack the middle dude. Like just ignore the skulls off to the side. Ow! Armina! Well, we can do a whole point different to do it with the Oh no! No! Oh, he absorbs fire, which is the last resort move. I meant to say he absorbs last resort because it's a fire move. <laughs> okay, so I couldn't dodge okay, that. I said he absorbed last resort because it was a fire move. But then shouldn't power jack have been fine? What the fuck? Okay, so is it an ex is it an expel move? It might be. I thought last resort was an almighty move. Now this is confusing again. Fuck. Well, okay. I so, never uh, use violent flash, but you say this should be a damage move, right? Instead of a. Uh, it won't work yeah. on this guy, will it? I doubt it. I'm gonna use Rakunda. <laughs> And then Kikurihime can do it too, because she has it also. But if I want to concentrate on... No, I could do that. I would like to load the defense for me. Ah, ah, jeez. No, I didn't mean to attack you, huh? Fuck. <laughs> well, you know what? You just heal everybody. <laughs> we'll be good as long as you do that. The best healer in the game for some reason. Better than Uzume for now, maybe? Ah, uh, fuck. Why did I skip it? <laughs> it's the first fucking thing on my list. Why did I not see it? <laughs> I think at some point I will replace Rakunda, maybe, because I already have her and like... Well, you know, it's like there's no reason for both people to have it, but it's not a bad thing to have. Wow, the damage is getting really hot already. Oh no, not the Eye of the Dragon. Uh, yeah, no, I'm just I'm remembering my times when I was fighting against this guy. And usually, eventually, that's it. Oh, jeez. Yeah, like, and that lowers, like, everything. Agility, defense, attack, like it's all lower thanks to debilitate. And at some point during the battle, like his skull body just cast that so much and they self destructed oh, constantly. No. And it's like, that's more or less this guy's gimmick. I can see that turning super bad. Yeah. So you need to take him down as quick as possible. And maybe uh, Rakunda ain't all that bad to do that in order to lower his defense. Yep. And also, Mulligan, Mulligan, not Mulligan, mulling it over. That's what I meant to say. Uh, Mulligan is trying it again. Mulling it over. Maybe heal everybody? Uh, it's probably a better option. <laughs> if we take damage from something, then at least we'll maybe survive. <laughs> right, and just, you know, a pimp smack to get yourself an extra turn. Yeah, uh, keep skipping past your <laughs> Okay, thank you, casting it four times at this point. Three. Damn it. Thank you for keeping count, though. <laughs> not like it's a bad thing. Uh, well, she's already healed everybody, so that's all I can do, really. I just remembered I meant to use my extra turn to get my MP back. God damn it. Stone boots. Well, that didn't hit. What about you, Death Man? Oh, fuck. We got a critical, but somebody missed, so hey, that, that equaled out. Okay. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. 
so... Just have to heal myself of the magic, because I'm going to do a tornado. Okay. Oh, uh, let's see. No, I don't need that much. Just me. The whole team's here. Wait, use why did that... on yourself? Did I just use a Soma? Yeah. I, I chose Chakra Drop. What the fuck? Okay, whatever. I just could have swore I used a Chakra Drop. Don't ever. I haven't used a Soma in, like, forever, right? Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. I might die. Let me make sure again by not using it. Okay. I... Okay, I used a Soma Droplet, and I thought it was a Chakra Drop somehow. Uh, well, I misread that greatly. I saw Chakra, and I saw Drop. <laughs> that's what it is. God damn it. <laughs> you see what I mean? Well, that's okay. It's one Soma Droplet. It's just for me. Just for me! Alright, what was I gonna do? Oh, yeah! Tornado. Even though I should do Raccoon to fuck whatever. Oh, uh, why not have uh, her use Raccoon? Yeah. That's true. Could I get an extra crit? Ah, fuck it. I like the little giggle. Now that I can hear her make a giggle as opposed to any game where I don't hear anything at all. Uh, okay. Just... What? Right. I was thinking this might not be too bad if you're able to keep one of them dead constantly. Well, that's never but gonna the thing happen. is, he's just gonna drag an eye and then do like this. This isn't so bad. I mean, she's still doing like up to the 300 somehow. Jack takes the damage from this. Then he does a thing. Okay. Okay. Well, now she's been stoned. That's pretty bad. Well, uh, gotta use an item to uh, stone the Kurihime, yeah? I'm trying to find that one. This stone kind of it. Yeah. I'm trying to find it, and I found it. Okay. Then just use her. Uh, right. Damage is getting pretty low. Like a uh, meteor Rama, I would presume. Like, that's what I mean. That would be a better idea. I was gonna smack him, but I thought, no, I'd be, uh, oh. and he's asleep still, so uh, the next best thing to do is throw a tornado! Yes! I mean, Deathman's almost dead, but he's not, so, oops. Right. Should've... And I, uh, oh, geez, those flashbacks again. Yeah. I, just, I remember that when he got closer to death, the more that those skeletons started to self destruct because they killed him when they self destruct. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, FYI, Jesus. you've been lowered by three levels now. Yeah, I could figure something like that. On the bright side, I'm not dead! Yeah! Tornado again. I'm gonna try it. I gotta hit him. I probably should just punch him, though, really, at this point. And I just realized the problem here. Oh, fuck. Uh, I was at... Yeah, I don't know I was looking for spells. That's for regular battle stuff. Oh, she's poisoned. How ironic since she has poison stuff. And then she took poison damage. I don't want to do a Mirage, that's a bad idea. Okay, I should just punch him, but that would be a bad idea. I have a tornado. But then, yeah, that's just me. It might miss, though, because it hasn't hit him yet. It's only hit one skull at a time. True, but it can hit, and at least it'll hit all of them, and you only have one action to do. Oh, it hit just him, and nobody else. Dead. So... Dead, dead, everybody dead. I like that Kakurihime survived with 1 HP. <laughs> and of everybody, she's the one that held on. Mm. Right. So, you see what I mean by you may want to just equip yourself with a magic Mago Tama so that you can just, like, blitz tornado him as quick as possible? Yeah. Okay. So, now that you've seen what death has in store for you... Literally. Like, we'll see how you will conquer this trial. In the next episode, Urgh, I'm gonna kill the most difficult rider. I'll, I'll show you guys.